Cardinals go 9-6-5-9-5-5-9-7 in their first three. Now Carly Teat ready to go. Casey has a nice fire team going. Just finishing up with her dismount, blind full into her double tuck. Brittany is very clean with nice lines on this event, which is gonna help her score out. Gets ready for her dismount, double layout. Giant pull into her double back. Gets ready for her dismount. Gainer pull. The nice landing. It was a great start for them. Ball State gets ready for her last pass. Ends with a double back. Getting ready for a dismount. Round up, one and a half to a stuck landing. Another great repeat for the Chippewas. She's going to get ready for her dismount. She has a cartwheel into a gainer layout full. And that should be another huge score for the Chippewas. She's a front full to a front high. Ready to finish out her routine. She's going to end with a Rudy. She's going to end with her dismount. She ends with a Rudy to her layout step up. Performed very nice. Should be a great score for them. I am just really blessed to coach this team. Um, it's, been, it's been a spectacular um, first half of the season. I've seen such growth in these young women, especially our freshman group. When I look at who we have in the lineup, um, the first thing that comes to my mind is, is our beam group. And not many people know this. You might, I don't know. But none of those beam people competed for us before this season. So to see the growth that's taking place, to see what's, what's transpiring there is, is phenomenal. And then when you go to um, our floor, just really excited for us to get a 49. I thought that was about two or three weeks away. Um, but um, to have Macy Hilliger back after three weeks being out um, and, and to do the, the job that she did for us today, I thought was just a great effort on her part. And you know the rest of the group keeps building and building, and uh, for us to be back in that 49 range, um, I think is is going to make a difference for us every meet.